I've always been curious about how an air conditioner actually cools a room Turns out it works by moving the heat from inside your house to the outside Inside the AC, there's a refrigerant called Freon It flows through pipes into the outdoor unit's compressor Where the gas gets squeezed tight when a gas is compressed Its pressure goes up and so does its temperature Reaching around 17, 6 degrees Fahrenheit This hot, high pressure gas then travels through the pipes into the outdoor condenser Now outside air might be under well in 4 degrees Fahrenheit So the temperature difference is huge With the help of a powerful fan blowing across it The gas quickly loses heat and condenses into liquid Kind of like steam turning into water droplets on the lid of a pot Even after cooling down Something called an expansion valve Inside the valve, there's a narrow passage And as the refrigerant passes through The pressure drops instantly Lower pressure means lower temperature By controlling the flow speed of the refrigerant The expansion valve regulates the cooling process Now the refrigerant has dropped to below 32 degrees Fahrenheit It travels through pipes into the indoor unit's evaporator A fan behind the evaporator blows air across it Sending cool air into the room same time, the cold evaporator coils meet the warmer indoor air, causing condensation to form on the surface. That's why you see water draining from an AC while it's cooling. Finally, the refrigerant gas leaving the evaporator gets sent back to the compressor, and the whole cycle.